Fidget toys! Do you have ADHD? Do you need something to always fiddle with and mess with? Well, have I got the treat for you. The ultimate assorted fidget toys. I got an entire assortment of 24? Yeah, 24 fidget toys. And it's got slime in here. By the way, I have another video that is similar to this one that's coming out soon. But we're very out of order because I'm trying to get stuff posted for you guys. So you're welcome, but it is out of order. Last time, I had to use a car key in order to open some plastic. This time, I'm not going to do that. <laughs> and yes, this is an actual knife, but don't worry. I've used it several times. I'm not going to hurt myself. YouTube, just settle down. No one's in danger yet. So, I'm I'm really curious. I, I wanted to get this first, but instead I got a Lego set. I wanted to get this, but I couldn't find it at the store. And I went to a different store and I ended up finding it. They have a lot of these deluxe fidget boxes that have different things in them. It's always different every time. But this one I specifically wanted because it has a Rubik's Cube. Alright, let's open this up. It says break here on the front of it. So... Oh my god, do I need the knife again? Aha! Get off of there, you! Alright, let's open this bad boy up. Maybe. Maybe. Oh, okay. Yeah, it's, it's just, it's, it's on there. It's, it's really on there. Alright. Hmm. What do we have here? This? Ooh. Whenever I record YouTube videos, as long as this doesn't come up in the microphone, I could actually use this. I think this is like a bicycle chain. That's kind of what it seems like anyway, but like, oh, all of it just moves. Oh, the satisfaction. Oh my God, it comes apart. This is dope. Oh, and you could spin in all sorts of different directions. Oh, that is awesome. All right, so cool, bicycle chain. I'd say that's a nine out. Jesus, this is a nine out of 10 right here. here let's just move this to the side. It, it's, in, it's in the way. So now we got an egg with tape on it. I'm assuming that it comes open. I don't know what it's for though. Alright, trusty knife. If I break this, I mean, I guess that's one less toy that needs to get used. Okay. Broke the plastic. What in the hell is this thing? Is it a squish? Oh! Oh, it opens! Oh, and, and there, there's gel? What, is, what does the gel do? Ah! Oh! Ah! Oh! Ah, oh, that's slimy as shit! Ah, oh, it's the egg. Eeh! Oh, what the f*** is that? <laughs> oh, that, that texture! Ew, that- Okay, that's gross. That- that's gross. Ew. No. Ah, some of it came out the sides. No! It's a 4 out of 10. I, I, I will never use this. For sure. Someone else can use it. Alright, let's open this up. It's a little... It's a little sunshine. It's a, it's a little sunshine for your cloudy day. I guess I could, like, squeeze it. I feel like that if I was, like, 25 years younger with smaller hands, this would work. But, like, I don't know... What else this would do? It looks like someone just painted a face on a ravioli. I could see where other people would use it, but for me, I I will never use this for sure. One out of ten, useless. This will not help me with my ADHD. This, I cannot just squeeze this. No, one out of ten, also useless. All right, it looks like I got two of these. Let's open it up. Oh, oh, okay, I see. All right, so I got two eggs that are full of slime. Because I just, I happened to look over and I saw this blue one right here. Okay. Well, we'll take a look at that in a minute. I got a ball right here. Ooh. This is kind of cool. Oh, it's dirty. Yeah. Does it bounce? Doesn't really bounce too good. How about this other one? Oh, dude. Oh! I didn't know they did Ah! Holy shit! Hey, why isn't this- OH MY GOD! <laughs> These are kind of cool. I'll give them a 7 out of 10, but yeah, that's that's actually kind of dope. Plastic! Plastic! I didn't realize that this was the multiple of slime that 
the thing was talking about, so. Egg number two. Ew! What the? F what in the hell? Hey guys, I'm almost 28 years old at the time of this recording. And I'm playing with children's toys. <laughs> now it's just stuck in my hand. It's just sitting there. Medicine me! Get off my hand. Oh my god. It leaves such a big mess. Jesus Christ. Okay, I can see how this could probably be a fidget toy because I'm fidgeting to get it the hell off. Oh my god, it won't even go back in the goddamn egg! One out of ten, that's- that's bullshit. Ooh! Oh! This is a cool-ass stress ball! These are really cool, they're- they're like, I wouldn't say spongy, but like, you- you know, like, you can grip it, and like, it slowly goes back to form, it's not just like a stress ball where you're like, ah, 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 ah. Like, th this- this is cool. I like this. Ten out of ten stress ball right here. In fact, this is gonna stay over here, this is gonna be the- Pile over here of stuff I will use for sure. We got a little rabbit. It is actually very cute. I, I will not discredit the rabbit. And we got a little pig. Like these are very cute. But just like with these, I can't really use them. It's not very useful to me to have these tiny ones. What is this? Chinese finger traps? Oh. Okay, so it's just, it's like Chinese finger traps closed up at the ends with a marble inside. And like you could just sit there and like just move the marble around. Ooh. I'm not going to show you guys every single one of them because it's all the same thing. They're just different colors. <laughs> you know, it's actually kind of satisfying. I'm actually impressed. These I'll give a, a 7 out of 10. You can't really do much with them. I can't really give them a 10 out of 10. All I can really do is just the model, which it serves its purpose. So it gets definitely credit for that, but still 7 out of 10. What in the hell is this? Is that a goddamn green bean? I could squeeze the thing and the green bean comes out. That, that's actually kind of cute. It's kind of cool. Oh, and then you could just like put it on a chain and then whenever you're bored, oh. You could just have the peas come out. Okay, I'm not going to mess with them right now, but it's cool. Cool. I, I definitely dig it. I'd say 8 out of 10. Th th this is a cool one. Look, you can pop the bubbles. Okay, th this is pretty cool. I could see how, like, you would just be sitting there and you're just bored and you're getting antsy and you're just like, Oh God, I got a job interview to go to. My wife's having a baby. Uh, random bullshit that people would, like, freak out about. I probably wouldn't use it a lot, so I'll give it a 7 out of 10, but it is pretty good. Octopus penises. Because it doesn't tell you anything else about them. Alright. Rocky, there's gonna be a big hit. Ready? These things are useless. Hey. No, don't play with them. I don't want you getting sick by eating them. 3 out of 10, because now I think my dog wants to eat them. Rubik's Cube! Rubik's Cube! I have never owned a Rubik's Cube. I have always been interested in messing with them, but I have never been good at solving a Rubik's Cube. I, the most I've ever done was I think I've solved two, solved two sides, and that's it. That's so wonderful. I'm going to try and scramble it up. I'll see if I can figure it out. Did I get a side yet? God damn it. You know what? Separate video just for this. 10 out of goddamn mother flippin' 10. And last but not least, I don't know what this is. The surrounding temperature should be between 0 and 50 Celsius. Keep out of direct sunlight. I'm gonna have like a weird smell. I'm probably still smelling the freaking noodle things. What in the hell is this? It's in a very cryptic box. Like, you can't really tell what's in there. You can tell it's like a gel of something, but... Dude, this is like a his and hers! Oh! Oh! That is cool! Woo! This is my new favorite thing. Oh, I could just sit here for hours with this. 
The blue one is just going like mad though. Look at that shit. That is cool. 11 out of 10 for this. Damn, I, I got stuck on that. You know what? You know what? We're gonna sacrifice one. Oh, hello there, little bunny. Oh, you look like you're so friendly. Oh, I didn't even slice through that. Holy shit. Mr. Bond, it's time to die. Oh my god, this thing is f***ing resilient. Right, you little bitch. Aha! Yeah! I think that these are good for anybody who has ADHD. If you need something that will help you out, these boxes seem like that they have some cool stuff. Maybe I'll get the other box and test out the other toys that are in there, see if there's anything different. So far, I've got some cool shit. And I guarantee you, I will never get bored. That is a fact.